Um, this issue, you know, housing issue, is a, is, is a national crisis, if not a scandal. And um, you know, I don't want to rain on the parade of the minister and his colleagues after yesterday's announcement. But it's the fourth such announcement since October, uh, seeking to promise the, the, the delivery of social housing units. And um, there isn't enough time in the what's allocated to me to go through the history of the dismal record in house construction under this government and the figure, figures that I have here following a PQ recently clearly indicate why this crisis has become a scandal. Suffice to say, Waterford, one unit in the last four years, Offaly, none, North Tip, none, 60 in Dublin out of 100 last year. It makes dismal reading, to be quite honest with you. And I would have hoped and have thought that you would have had a more holistic approach to this crisis long before now, but even at this late stage, that you would have combined the private sector and empowerment initiatives to help and assist that sector, whether it be in the, in, in the realm of uh, social, social uh, investment fund, the strategic investment fund being used uh, to, to fund developers to get house building going, to address the difficulties that are there, that there are no houses available, there's an increasing crisis in relation to mortgage interest arrears, mortgage rates arrears, a crisis in relation to uh, the whole construction element of providing house building, house uh, homes, and you know you've ma made no effort to address those issues. I would have thought you would, but having said that, and, and, and to deal with the specific issue that I've raised here, and it relates to some of the previous announcements made uh, by your government and by your, 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 your frontline minister in this area, and particularly, you know, the seven and a half thousand capital funds, including. Uh, new builds, acquisitions and refurbishments and voids and so forth that was promised over a period of three years. You say to be seven and a half thousand. Just a couple of months ago, you know, under questioning at a committee meeting and, and indeed I think through PQ, it, we were informed that 1,400 would be new builds and it would be completed by the end of this year. Now we have an announcement yesterday that says it will be 1,700 by the end of 2017. So are 300 going to be built in the next, in, in the year 2016 and 17 and 1,400 this year? So I specifically want to ask on foot of that announcement yesterday, notwithstanding the difficulties arising out of the crisis and the, the management of it over the last four years and the, 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 the fact that it was left uh, to, to develop into a scandal, as I mentioned, of 1,000 children up. living in emergency accommodation in Dublin alone. But, you know, was the, was, when, when the question was answered two months ago, were you and your, 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 your colleagues convinced that 1,400 units were going to be built this year. And what has changed Call on in two Ferris months now. to announce yesterday that Deputy. it's now 1,700 over three years? And I know we're only dealing with one strand. So my question only dealt with one strand. And that strand is the direct build sector, that you have authority to provide local authorities to provide for the 90,000 people, individual applicants. It could be 200,000 people. But having said that, if you want to talk and compare and contrast what was built in the last four years with what went before you, you built none in Waterford, for example, none in Offaly, none in Leash, none in North Tip. I have the list here, I can go through them. If you want to play that game, you lose that one, I can tell you. But now what I want to ask you now is what I asked you earlier. Why did your senior minister tell me two months ago 1,400 new direct built units would be provided by this government and local authorities throughout this country this year? That was two months ago. You see, you rush to make so many announcements, you forget what you said in the previous one. Is that what she said two months ago? Yesterday, it's back to 1,700 over three years. So what I'm saying to you is, can you confirm to be 1,400 this year and 300 in the next two years? Is that the divide? Or why did you tell me to be 1,400 built two years ago and you tell the country there's only going to be 1,700 over three years yesterday? Because people don't trust you anymore. They don't and believe. And they see Deputy, in black and you. white the disregard Deputy you Ferris, have for the housing provision element of local authorities Count, in this country. Zero, zero, there's more zeros Deputy here Count, than anything the else. Is waiting, and they're not the euros. Questions. They're duck eggs. Please, nothing have... built, nothing provided. You're you have no interest in sorting time. out the housing crisis. You've allowed it to develop Deputy into a national scandal.